match every football fan looks forward to. A lot on the line and the likelihood of a tension-packed occasion. We have all the action for you live on EA TV. And hello from the King Abdullah Sports City here in Jeddah in Saudi Arabia. I'm Derek Ray at the microphone and joining me for match commentary is Stuart Robson. And on the menu today, live action from the Pro League coming up. It's Al Itihad and they face Al Nasser. Thanks Derek. Well, both managers will be reminding their players of starting the game quickly, pinning the opposition back, playing the ball forward and regaining possession as quickly as possible. Hopefully we get a really good game here. The initial 11 today for the hosts. Well, they're starting with an attacking 4-5-1 formation with three players in advance of two holding midfielders. But it's important that the wide players come in field to join the centre forward at the right time. This is the lineup for the visitors today. Well, the shape is the same, but they may play it in a slightly different way. And key to this game will be the fullbacks. Do they tuck in alongside their centre halves or look to support their wingers? I hope it's the latter. Abdul Rahman Harib. A good and fair challenge. Well, possibilities in the centre. Well, as you can see, when it comes to the hosts, they certainly know a thing or two about scoring goals. In fact, Stuart, they have the most potent attack in the league. Well, the movement of the front players is key. They're always threatening the space behind the opposition, and when the ball does go wide, they work so hard to find that bit of room away well, from Well, they could finish line. here, Stuart. Well, he stumped it out of there without much fuss. Benzema, well, plenty of power, but just too much height on it. Gary. Anderson Tavisca. Just the challenge that was required. Gary. And back with Luis Gustavo. Very quick thinking there. Romarinho. And threading it forward. Well, the flag was up in good time, bringing that move to an end. Well, he's just got to be more patient there. He's gone too early. Conor. Ball with Alvaro. Anderson Talisca. A oh, terrific pass. Just couldn't capitalise there. That was perfectly timed. And it is going to be a corner. Elects to go short. Anderson Talisca. Well, going for power. But what can you say about it, really? Not great. The referee's letting it go as they keep the ball. Possession lost. And do they mean business on this occasion? Alvaro. Dicing with a bit of danger here. Successfully cut out. Yeah. 
trying to really get at the opposition here. Ronaldo. Well, it wasn't a simple save to make. Let's see about the delivery. Not quite the accuracy he was looking for. That'll be a goal kick. Romarinho. Being egged on by the crowd. Oh, good work by the keeper. Well, just listen to these fans. They're urging their team to score here and take the lead. Able to deal with the threat. Coronado. A really top-notch piece of defending. Cristiano Ronaldo. This might be the perfect counter-attacking opportunity. Ronaldo threading it through. Credit to them for winning back possession. Ronaldo. He's in behind. Well, whatever way you slice it, a long, long way from the target, Stuart. Well, a lack of technique and composure there, that's a bad miss. And the fourth official confirming that we'll have one additional minute. So nothing to choose between the teams at half-time as the referee blows his whistle. Stuart, your impressions of our hosts? Well, after giving their attacking play the big build-up, they've let us down. They haven't quite been as fluid, the strikers haven't got the better of their markers and they've just missed a couple of chances, but I'm still sure they'll score goals in the second half. Well, as they get the ball rolling again, interesting to see how this second half pans out. Luis Gustavo... Ronaldo. Now he must favour the cross. Interception to snuff out the danger. It was always likely to be the goalkeeper's ball. Well, those stats aren't great reading, are they? Neither side is playing with any fluency so far, and as a result, we've seen a pretty dull game. It has to get better. Top-class defending. And they will be awarded a free kick for that. Kono. Luis Gustavo with it. And a strong tackle. Romarinho. Benzema. Are they going to forge ahead? Flinging himself at it, the keeper. And the short option preferred. Ahmed Sharahili. Abdul Rahman Al Obud. Well, he took care of it defensively. Romarinho. Well, the fans really want him to shoot. And not cleared away properly. Oh, it strikes the bar. A super tackle, and they've won possession. Anderson Tavisca. Can he finish? And effectively parried away by the keeper. Abdul Rahman Al Obud.
A sloppy pass. Ronaldo. Well, a classic example of how to intercept. Anderson Talisca. Well, forward they go again. Can they win this? Talisca! Oh, a goal! And is that going to be the one that wins it for them? There's every chance, and the fans are lapping this up. Well, this replay shows just how good Ronaldo is when he runs with the ball, but there's still plenty for him to do. Under all sorts of pressure from the defender, he's just able to keep him at bay and finishes with a plumb. It's a great goal. What a big moment in the dying embers. Will it prove decisive here? Trailing as they are, they're not likely to get too many opportunities late in this game. And that's very good refereeing to let the play flow. Superb effort to keep it in. Ronaldo at the ready. Will it happen for him here? He's foiled them on his own. Well, the counter chance looks very real. Well, this game is far from over. They'll probably get one more big chance before the end. The crowd certainly thinks so. Just listen to that noise. Benzema! A goal! Sheer excitement! Level again here! So, a level contact. And there is the referee's whistle for full time. Even Steven here, they can't be separated. We were triggered to goals. And Stuart, interested to get your verdict. Well, Derek, what a good game it was. Plenty of chances, some good...